What's up guys, welcome back to another Banger YouTube video. Today we're just going to be showing you guys how to take off a, a guard of an echo string trimmer. So what you want to do is right here on the side, there's this little hole. I don't know if you guys can see it, it's right there. You want to line that up with, um, just line that up. So it would probably be like this or something and just find the hole and line it up. And what you're going to do there, you're going to put a screwdriver you're gonna insert it in, in the hole. That way it's, it's, you can just, something to like hold it in place. Then you're gonna turn the head clockwise to the right. So on the clock, it goes one, two, three, four, five, go that way. You just turn it. You're gonna wanna hold it from here. Cause if you twist from here, you're not gonna really twist it off. Yeah, at first it's a little tight. Hey, that's what she said. So you're gonna wanna twist it off from here. So you twist it off with both hands if you have to. Just keep twisting until it fully comes off. So you twisted it off, just put that aside. You take the screwdriver out. You're gonna wanna take the gear thing off. You take that off. It's, it, it can, when you take it off, it's gonna be like this. And then you pull it off. And then you put that aside as well. So then you clean off the little grass that has it. So from this angle, this is the gear. There's two sides to so it. This side goes right here. And then the head, you would just screw it back on like that. But when you take the head off, you have the gear right here. And then you have three screws. These are the funky looking screws, the one that look like stars. So you're gonna, if you don't have one, then you're gonna have to buy that. If not, then just literally put the gear back, gear thingy back on and then screw the head on and you're good to go. But if you do have the screw and you can actually take the uh, guard off, you're gonna wanna find the head you need. Yeah, so you're gonna need a T27. Uh, that's how the head looks like, it's one of the stars. But that's what it's called. If you go to Home Depot or anything, you just get this. It's like a drill bit. Or you can get a screwdriver that come like that too. But that's what you're going to want. If it fits right into the three little bolts you need. So you just want to get that. And just unscrew them. There's three of them, so there's one on top. One right there. You guys can see that, and then one right there. So it's one, two, three, and you unscrew all of those three. This one, this one, and that one. And one more. then when you take that off this is like a, a washer a spacer you pull this off like that's the clean side that's the dirty side i don't think it really matters but if you want just put the clean side back on so after you take the bolts off this is going to look you pull this off and then the guard just comes right off and then when you take the guard off you put everything back on so you put the washer on and then Hey! Once you put the washer on and you put the bolts in, remember the bolts go one, two, Take the gear, remember this faces out and this goes in. You guys wanna look at it sideways. You put that in. And then you 
Screw that. This, literally just insert and twist. And then you just put, this, put the screw in again. This is from the beginning, a nice head look for it. This is what you're looking for. That, that entrance right there. That entrance, you put the screw in. Let's press it tight, but you can't unscrew it. And then Let's turn it on to see if the head falls off or anything. So the head doesn't fly off, so that means we did it good. And um, that's the final product. No more guard, because guards are kind of booty, but however you like um make hope you guys like this video if it helped you in any way make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe peace